Hey guys, real quick, I wanted to do a video on uh, our November ad that we're running on Facebook and Instagram right now. Um, Facebook's making a ton of changes to their business platform. It's been really frustrating the last couple months, some of the stuff they've been doing that has caused issues within the platform. So I'm just going to run through this real quick so you can see kind of a glitch that has been problematic. Uh, first thing you want to do when you have your posts for the month, you definitely want to pin it so that's at the top for the month. That's the first thing we do is pin the new post. Uh, when we go to boost the post, one thing you have to look out for, and this is this is weird, and I'm going to go through this so that everyone can see it. Um, when we change this audience detail, right, we're going to change it real quick. Um, and we make the parameters different, and I'm just doing this for... For example, sake. Let's go ahead and pull this down to a five mile radius. Let's exit out of this one. Let's save audience. All right. But then we go and change this to 500 it changed our audience back to Hanover plus 10 and um, and then it changed the ages back so that's just something you gotta be really careful of because if you go and make this change and then you change the dollar amount then you're going to um, you're going to impact where you're having that ad and so what you need to do is pick your dollar spend first then go back and edit the ad. So now that we've picked $500 as our ad spend, we're going to go ahead and make all the changes. So we're going to change it to learn more website. We're going to change the landing page to coupon.costoils.com. Now we can go in. Uh, actually, what we want to do is make sure we change the duration because that is another thing that triggers a change in the audience detail. I don't know why it has this glitch right now, but it, it can cause some issues if you don't make sure you're targeting the right place. So we're going to age up to 25 because there's really not a lot of kids younger than 25 on Facebook. We're going to X out of this. We're going to put in our address, 224 York Street, Hanover, PA. Here it is. We're going to bring that down to a five mile radius. We don't want any detail targeting. If anything's in there, you want to X out of it. We're going to save that audience. Now we have five mile radius around 224 York Street, Hanover, Pennsylvania, ages 25 to 65, 28 days, $500. We're going to go ahead and click boost post now. Um, this will run it on both Facebook and Instagram. We have everything set up the right way. So that's just a pitfall to avoid. Um, it'll be important to make sure that um, you catch that because otherwise your, your, your ad will be too broad based. It'll hit too many people that aren't going to care. If it's a 30 mile radius, then there's just going to be a whole bunch of people who are not going to care about the ad and it's going to be a waste of your ad spend. You need to keep your ad spend within a four mile, five mile radius depending on um, your 50,000 person uh, radius is usually what you want to go by. So this will go into review. It'll get approved because this is the same type of ad we run every month. And this is just uh, something for you guys to keep an eye out for.